five, six, seven, eight. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. I'm the dance captain of the Cookie Monster in Sesame Street Live, and I like just transferred in from another Broadway show um, onto that tour. And then when I ended that tour, I got a job opportunity out here working at a dance uh, studio, a dance academy. And so I lived here for a year, and then I booked another show, and then from there, I met my, my now husband. We got married, I live in Detroit, and then I moved to Chicago. And since then, I've been back here almost every fall to help choreograph their musical. Now, this is the first time I've ever worked with their show choir. Okay. Um, when I was in high school, technically when I was in sixth, seventh, and eighth, nope, seventh, eighth, and ninth grade, I was in a show choir in my high school in California. Um, and then I transferred to an arts high school and we didn't have a show choir. And so my show choir didn't really compete, but um, visually, like I've worked on music videos, I know what like choreography or um, or staging sometimes really captivate an audience and how to best smoke and mirror the moment in which you're like oh we don't know this or like this is not our strongest point I go okay there's no reason for you to fret over it I mean at the end of the day this is not like a Broadway call this is your, you're getting on stage and sharing your passion and so I'm gonna give them the best tools to not enhance their strengths but also put where they have hurdles of opportunity for growth in a space where it's not so obvious um, and so like that's what I've been working on.